Hello. Hello, teacher. Good evening. Hello, good evening. How are you today? Uh, I am fine, teacher. And you? I am very well. Thank you for asking, Angela. It's good to see you. Me too, teacher. It's very good. Ready for a new class? Yes. Okay, perfect. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, on time. Yes. You are in time. <laughs> In time, okay. In time, in, time, uh -huh. in time is before the time is stipulated. And on time is like at eight. Punto. Si llega a las ocho es en punto, on time. Pero si on es time. antes de la hora es in time. Ah, okay. In time, on so time. Are, yeah, you are in time for the class. <laughs> Hello, me. Sorry, how are you? Yeah, I'm fine. Thank you. Nice. I like your background. Hey, dude, did you? Very good. I like your background. Me gusta su fondo. I like your background. Ah, uh, yes, teacher. Ah, sí, teacher. Uh, it's very nice. Yes, in contact with nature. In contact with the naturaleza, in contact with the nature. <laughs> yeah. Teacher, este, solo, solo. Sí, sí, adelante, mi. Hola, Osmi. Este, ahorita voy a estar en un arrancado. Voy a estar con el sin la cámara. Sí, okay. teacher. Voy a estar en una reunión, pero sí voy a estar conectado sin cámara, por favor. Okay, perfect. Thank you for informing. Thank you, teacher. Okay. Good evening. Okay. Hello, good evening, Rafa. How are you, Rafa? Sorry. How are you? Good evening. Fine. Oh, nice. Good evening, Miguel. How are you? Sad. 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 <laughs> So, because uh, the role is look more complicated. Ah, oh, I imagine. And the game? How was the game? No, no, it's the the game. <laughs> My goodness, it was a, it was a terrible game, right? Yes, it's terrible. Uh -huh. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. You don't know where <laughs> the selector is going. <laughs> <laughs> No, I, I was telling your classmates yesterday that I had hopes. Yo ten, and Darwin, que yo te, tenía esperanza en realidad. I, I had hopes. Ah, okay. <laughs> yeah, but, but anyways. Yes, yes. And the problem is that Jamaica is going up. Jamaica, Jamaica va subiendo. Jamaica is going up. Yes, yes. Uh... Yeah, so, um, I mean, we don't know in the next matches with Jamaica. And I hope, and I think they want to, to escalate in the table. No, I think is the classificated is uh, USA, Mexico, and, and yeah. Canada. Directly, directly, right. directly, directly. Yes, directly. directly. And for the four, the four, yes, the four plays, the plays it is, no, the four plus Uh huh. Uh, maybe, no, I don't know. It's a, it's a very complicated, this, this, the, yeah, the fourth, <laughs> the fourth position is very complicated to define. Yes, yes. But, but, yes, I, yes. but I think, according to mm -hmm. how Jamaica is playing lately, I think Jamaica could, could get it. Creo que así como viene jugando mm -hmm. Jamaica los últimos partidos, podría, podría entrar a repechaje. Mm -hmm. Jamaica is uh, very bad in, in, in the uh, before. In the mm -hmm. Yes, yes, yes. Panama, Only... possibly, right? Maybe Panama. Mm -hmm. mm, Costa Rica, maybe. Uh -huh. I... mm. It's it's, well, it's rare. It's rare Panama. Nowadays, I, I mean, know. nowadays Panama is better than Costa Rica nowadays. Yes, yes. I don't know. It's a complicated the for yeah. Form. Yeah, I know. All right. Hello, everybody. Good <laughs> evening. Good evening. Hello, Mayra, Ada, Nelson, and others. <laughs> Hello, teacher. Hello, how are you? Hello. Good evening, teacher. Okay, Mayra, I ask about your doubt. Pregunté, todavía no me han contestado, but I ask, okay? Okay, thank Supposedly you. Supposedly, they are going to check, okay? Supposedly. Okay. So I will let you know later when they check. Okay. Okay, so let's start then, and let me pass the attendance uh, to begin with the class. Ada? 
Adriana. Ana Michelle. Present. Angela. Present, teacher. Darwin. Present, teacher. Flor. Gloria. Joana. Lourdes. Present. Present, teacher. Okay, Margarita. Present. All right, Margarita. Welcome. One, two, three. One, two, three. Okay. Margarita, muchas asistencia ya, Margarita. Aira. Present. I'm sorry. <laughs> okay. Mayra. Uh, yeah, she's the present. I'm sorry. Miguel. Okay. Present teacher. Nelson. Present teacher. Ofelia. Present teacher. Okay. Osmi. Teacher present. Me estaba conectando y no, no pude lograr a tiempo okay. decirle. Okay, it's okay. No problem. Rafael. Rosa. Present. Good evening. Right on time. Good evening. Yes. <laughs> Sandra. Jansi. Present picture. Surma. Present. Asalia. Ingrid. And Susana. Okay, very good. Here, teacher Gloria. Okay, okay, Gloria. I will put it the second, the, the second, uh, on the second, the second time. Okay, good. So everybody, uh, welcome to this, um, to this session. And well, for today, um, I remember yesterday. Well, Miguel was not present yesterday, right? Who else? Quien más no estuvo ayer? Who else was in class yesterday? Margarita, right? Was in class. Me. And from the others, let me see. Lourdes, me. were you in class? Yes, right. No, no, was not in class. Yes, I know. Okay, who else? Mm -hmm. Let me see here. Joanna was present. Yes, right. No, Joanna was not present. Hi, Joanna. Mm -hmm. All right. Uh, I am asking because yesterday uh, your classmates were preparing. Um, a presentation about the steps to make a, a training good menu. Evening. All right. Hello, good evening. Uh, your classmates were preparing a presentation uh, to make a training manual. All right. And they designed, some people designed PowerPoint, some people uh, designed Word docs or other docs. Okay. But the idea is to present uh, the information you have to the class. Okay. And listen. Everybody has to pay attention because the information your classmates are going to share is going to be used later. Okay, la información que ellos van a con comparar, que ustedes van a, comp a, a, con a compartir, perdón, to share, va se va a ser usada luego para una actividad que vamos a hacer. So please pay attention when your classmates present. Okay, pay attention when your classmates present. So is everyone ready to present? Or you need five minutes? If you need five minutes, I can send you with the group and then you, I mean, you take the five minutes and then we present. Do you need five minutes? I can give you five minutes, but tell me. Tessa, I'm mejor, you know better. Yes. Yes? Yes, please. Okay. Yes. I will give you five minutes then for the groups and listen, listen, please. Uh, practice the pronunciation. You can read, but practice the pronunciation. At least I want to see good pronunciation, okay? Al menos me gustaría ver buena pronunciación. I would like to see good pronunciation, okay? So please, uh, take these five minutes to prepare and practice, okay? Um, okay, teacher. En el caso de los que no estuvieron ayer, se pueden unir al equipo que ustedes quieran. Okay, so in the case of Margarita, Joanna, um, who else? Lourdes, I think, right? No? Yes, and Miguel. So you can join the team you want. Pueden unirse al equipo que quieran ustedes. You can join the team you want. Okay, we have six teams. All right. Uh, team number one is Rosa, Azalia, and Sandra. Group number two is Michelle, Ingrid, Ada. 
Group number three is Zulma, Gloria, and Ophelia. Uh, group number four is Rafael and Flor. Group number five is Darwin and Nelson. And group number six is Angela and Osmin. Okay, sorry. Yeah? So you can join any team you want. Ustedes pueden unirse al equipo que quieran, okay? So please, from this moment, I will give you five minutes and then we present to the class, okay? Five minutes, all right, no more. Five minutes. Teacher. Yes? And my group is, is está eh, Mayrita y quién era la otra niña? Um, Angela is with Osmin, or no? Y ta, sí, pero está también Mayrita y... Ah, sí, se unió al final. Susana. Ajá, Susana, yeah. ajá, somos... Ajá. Cuatro. Yes. Ok, it's Para fine. que lo... Ajá. Yes, it's Mayra, you are with... Uh, no, no la tengo anotada porque se unió al final la Mayra. Ok, por eso no la tengo aquí en el listado. Ok, uh, thank, you, que, thank you, teacher. For me. Okay. So thank please, you. everybody, select the group uh, you are with and go to practice five minutes. Ok, and then we present. Y luego venimos a presentar. And then we come to present. Ok, any question? No? Ok, seleccionemos el grupo entonces. So, yes? Um, ¿Quién va a decidir? ¿Quién va a poner? ¿O nosotros lo You decide, you decide. It's your decision. Ok. It's your decision. Ok, seleccionemos el grupo en el, en el que están, por favor. Select the group where you are right now, ahorita. Right now. So Miguel, you can choose any team you want from one to six, okay? It's your decision. Yes, okay. yes, yes. Right. I, I only see when he's center. All right. Uh, the same for Joanna. Okay, you can choose any team you want, Joanna. Hi, teacher. Hello, Joanna. Hello. Puede, hello. Puedes seleccionar un equipo para ir a trabajar, el que quiera, porque, porque ya prepararon ellos la presentación casi, solo van a practicar, ¿ok? Usted decide okay, a qué teacher. equipo va a ir a trabajar. Ok, eh, le escribí a, este, a WhatsApp que si podía estar de oyente. Ah, ok, ok, let me check. Pero, pero todavía no ha comenzado la reunión, así que voy a participar. Ok, ok, thank you. Bueno. Eh, no sé quién me quiere en su equipo. <risa> ya se fueron todos a su equipo. Solo falta ah, bueno. Ozu. Ajá. Ahí usted, okay. usted decide a cuál se va a unir. It's your okay. decision. Ok, gracias. Ok, Flor, which group? Hi. Sorry, Teacher, se me fue el internet. Ah, Flor. esta Flor. Ok, Flor is with Rafael. Okay. Yes. ¿En qué grupo están, Flor? ¿En qué grupo? Four. Ok. Ofelia, ¿en qué equipo está? Ustedes. Ahí están los chicos que. que... Joana, comes here too. Joana era. Sí, híjole, ¿cuántos somos? <ríe> ya como. Sí. Cinco. Como, como ocho. <ríe> Don Osmin va a participar o, o está en sí, reunión. Fíjense que le pedí permiso al teacher porque está en una reunión de trabajo. Ah, ok, ok. okay. Pueda, ah, sí, vaya. Final, ah, está bien. Y... Está bien, Don Osmin. Bueno. Ok. Bye. okay. Ah, pues, Chicos, Yo no se va a participar, ¿verdad? Sí, en este momento ah, se vale. puede. Vaya. Entonces, Entonces eh, yo tenía el último párrafo. No sé, Miguel, cuál, cuál quisiera y cuál quisiera yo, Anita. Eh, el, que, el que esté disponible en el programa. Ángel, Ángela, ¿cuál tenía usted? El uno, pero... El uno. Ah, yo cualquiera, ustedes me dicen. Ah, entonces, oh. el uno lo tiene Ángela. Yo tiene tengo usted, el Miguel? último. Ok. Si gusta usted con el tercero, Joana, yo con el, con, okay, perdón, con el segundo y yo con el tercero. Ok, step 
Try, assemble, and deliver your manual. Así era, ¿verdad? En manual. Manual, ok. Manual. Manual. Uh, manual. 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 To assemble the training manual, the science ways to create a template in this nudging. This will shift to a select imagine or video that we need to include in the manual. Add text, establish order, and make it the process process as easier. Easier. It's correct. Easier. The Next. process. In this case, it's the process. The process, when, verdad? Cuando era proceso, se decía process. Y cuando era procesar, es process. Okay, esa es la diferencia. That's the difference, okay? Process. Y so, in this case, it's el proceso. So, you say the process easier. Easier. The process easier. Exactly. Okay, thank you, teacher. Okay. Go ahead, Next. Joanna. Joanna, you are next. Okay. The document can be saved in PDF or as No, an... no, no, no. Uh, the second, the second paragraph. No, era el tercero. Ah, okay. No sé, a mí me dijeron el tercero. O, o hago el sí, segundo. Sorry, I, I mistake. Uh, yes, yes, the second. Okay. It's Snagit. What is Snagit? It's a program. Ah, okay. It's Snagit. Yeah, the pronunciation. Uh -huh, Snagit. 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 Snagit includes templates that can be chosen for free and paid premium templates and other resources in Teach Smith access for Snagit. The document can be saved in PDF or has or has an image and is ready for sharing. Another option would be to create a base support center with Sendesk or Medcap Flare. Flare 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 tools. Flare tools. No. Flare, Flare tools. tools. And you say image. Image no image. Ah, image. As an image, that's right. As an image. As an image. Yeah. Okay. Okay. If you are creating an online knowledge base, you should be able to use video, image, and writing content all at the same time. So get creative and make content that covers everything your audience might need. Lo que vamos a decir, eh, eso debería de ponerlo como parte para que no se vea. Ajá, no, lo... así tendría que ser. Ajá, así para es... que no se vea, sola, así. Si lo pone así, no se ve la nota. Ah, vaya. Pero si la extiende un poquito más, sí se ve. Ok. Vaya, ah, pues así está bien. Así está bien. Uh -huh. Y siempre agregar el, el, el punto final. Ah, yo apago el micrófono. Okay. Check the spelling. Hello. Check the spelling of first. How do you write first? First. Is S T S T. All right. First is F I R S T. All right. First. No entendí. S, ahí, S, y, el, y la final se la quita. Es R, R, no, 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 no. Vamos a first. Va, L, e, L, e, ajá. Ahora ponemos una R, S, T, espacio, ok. Así, espacio, dale un espacio, identity. Ajá. Excelente. Yeah. yeah, that's okay. That's okay. Yeah. 
Uy, no me acuerdo si esta llevaba una. It's okay, it's okay, Zulma. Comprehend, it's okay. Ajá. But the pronunciation is comprehend. 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 Okay. Hola, Ophelia. Eh, Zulma, recién eh, ingresa Ophelia. Ah, ok. Estamos... Are you ready? Are you ready? Yes. Yes, you are. Okay, can you pronounce please so I listen to you? Can you pronounce? Floor full. Full present. Floor. <laughs> you? Okay. Can you put the num the number one? The how do you say diapositiva, teacher? Slide. 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 The first slide. 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 Okay. Yeah. Okay, we we are going to talk about the step four. Determine, de, determine, determine content pre, content presentation format. By Rafael and Flor. By. By by Rafael Flor, uh, Margarita, and Lourdes. Okay. By Rafael Flor, Margarita, and Lourdes. So right by. Uh -huh. Yeah. Lourdes, ya no la veo. Hello. Uh. <laughs> I'm here. <laughs> okay. Okay. First, you know your aud audience. Audience. What? Teacher? Audience. Audience. Yes, I, I would say, I would say in this case, in this step, I would say get to know your audience. Get to know your audience. Audience. Uh -huh. O podría ser, you need to know your audience. Necesitas conocer tu audiencia. You need to know your audience. You need to know the, your the, audience. The, the word? You need no no but before you need to know all right so ah, this, okay. uh, you need to know your audience and necessita audience. 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 audience 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 yeah oh. y audience termina con e c e c e all right no audience para que les corrija ahorita todo. Yeah. Yeah. Pónganle en inglés. Oh. Okay. Falta la Y donde dice you need oh, no. to know. No. No, pero si decimos, si decimos you, bueno, si dices our audience, al principio yeah. tendría que decir we. We. Ajá. We, right? Uh, we, we need to know our audience. Necesitamos conocer nuestra audiencia. Nuestra audiencia. Ok, continue. Ok. Rafa, the next. After that, you have to identify the options for delivery. 
Margarita. Afterwards, you consider the audience's context. Lourdes. Then, you selection the topics more suitable to video, text, or imagery. Mm -hmm. give, give me, okay, hold on, hold on. Then you select. Suitable. You select, all right? Select, not selection because you need a verb. Tú elí, tú seleccionas. Selection es selección. Okay, you select the topics more suitable to your video, yours. Text or imagery? What do you mean by imagery? Imágenes aparecen. Ah, then you say uh -huh. images. Images, ima, images. It's different. Uh, okay. Uh -huh. Imagery es una figura literaria, creo yo. Imagery. Ah, oh, okay. Yeah. Metáforas That's encontré. Ajá. Uh -huh. <laughs> ok, continue. Okay. And finally, you combine different formats in one and provide rich media support content. Yeah, that's okay. You only say different, uh, different. Okay, in singular, not in plural. Not in plural, uh, but different. different. A los adjetivos en inglés nunca se pluralizan, nunca. Okay. Uh, okay. Mm -hmm. okay, very good. That's excellent. Okay, teacher. So pra practice again, please. Very Okay, teacher. Third, third, third. Yes. Rosetta. It's like third. it's like a U. Uh -huh. It's like a U. Third. 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 <laughs> don't, don't be don't be freak out <laughs> okay after after that to increase, increase organization increase. increase organizational productivity productivity then then companies and organization create training create. models that create 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 training manuals that support their customer. Finally, they are a fundamental resource and a successful company provides them. Successful. Conclusion is successful. Successful. Successful, yeah. <laughs> successful company yeah. provides them. Yes. Conclusion is if done right, a good training manual becomes a trusted resource for employees and managers or customers and clients. Yes. Yes. We're ready, teacher. <laughs> I, I, don't, I don't know if it's me, but, um, but in this case, uh, maybe you can say successful company or successful companies. Mm. 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 Let me find the document. We, we copy from the document, please. <laughs> <laughs> we copy from the document. <laughs> the problem, the problem, the problem is the document. <laughs> yes. Yes, because okay. we do copy, we make copy paste. <laughs> uh -huh. Copy, copy. Let me, let me, let me. Copy paste. Let me finally wait. Yeah, it's it's okay. The, the purpose is okay. Uh -huh. Toda compañía yes. exitosa. Uh -huh. Yeah, the purpose is fine. It's okay, Rosa. Okay. okay. Uh -huh. No, teacher, no. Es que no nos encontró error, por eso. Solo, le, solo, le estaba, solo la estaba probando, a ver si había leído. Uh -huh. <laughs> in, the, in, the, in the other one, yes. Companies and organizations. On the ah, second, companies and organizations create training oh. manuals that support their customers in plural. Oh, yes, in organizations, uh -huh. okay, organizations customers. and customers. Yes, let me mm -hmm. let me change. Yeah, it's okay. Thank you. And organizations, organizations, 
support yes. their customers. Organization. Support their customers. Ah, in uh -huh. Uh -huh. Support. Uh -huh. support. Uh -huh. support. Uh -huh. Support. No, no, support is okay. Ah, okay. Support is okay. It's customers. customers. Uh -huh. Ah, okay. Ah, okay. Yes, yes. Apoyan a sus empleados, a sus clientes. Okay? Oh, yes, yes, yes. Yeah. Okay, okay. Only okay. continue. Okay, thanks. <laughs> okay, let me find. Okay, Asalia. <laughs> <coughs> my God. <coughs> Yo ya lo dije, lo vuelvo a decir. Okay, es que soy la más difícil. After that, to increase organizational productivity, then companies. Es que me, me lo tapa aquí, esto. Okay. Companies and organization create training manuals that support their customers. Finally, they are a, fun, a fundamental resource and all successful company provides them. Conclusion, if done right, a good training manual becomes All right, all right. So I, I said five minutes, right? And I gave you like 18 minutes, like 18 or 20 minutes, but it's fine. I could see you were uh, you were practicing, okay? So it's it's okay. It's not wasted time. No es tiempo desperdiciado. It's not wasted time, okay? I know you were practicing, 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 and practicing, all right? So no problema. Okay, let's start. Um, so we are going to start then in the same order. Okay, listen, please, everybody. Pay attention to these steps pay attention to this information and if necessary take notes in the si es necesario pueden tomar notas si quieren you can take notes if you want okay the idea is that we apply this information in a moment because in a moment you are going to create a mini manual you are going to create a mini manual in groups it's not a big manual a mini manual all right a mini one yeah so please pay attention all right please pay attention and take notes if you want yeah, so we are going to start uh, with the first group with the purpose of a uh, manual. Rosa, Asalia, and Sandra. Um, good evening. Uh, we are going to present the introduction for this activity. And is uh, what is the purpose of a training manual? A training manual is a set of instructions that improve the quality with which, which a job process or task is performed. Uh, continue, Sandra. Okay. Companies use training manuals with in person, remote, on demand, and just in time training. A few common applications include perks, onboarding new employees, seco, rolling out new software and system, third, customer training and education. Continue, Asalia. After that, to increase organizational productivity. Then companies and organizations create training manuals that support their, support their customers. Finally, they are a fundamental resource and all successful company provides them. Conclusion, if done right, a good training manual becomes a trusted resource for employees and managers or customers 
and clients. Encantado. Thanks for your attention. Okay, thank you very much. Okay, very good. Yes, I know the information is not very easy, okay? But the idea is that um, a training manual is a, se a series of steps, is a series of steps for a task or for a job, all right? Different steps for a training, for example. So you use a training manual at the time of a training, okay? So thank you very much, Rosa's group. So can you please close the presentation? Thank you. Good. Now, please, everybody, go to reactions and let's give them a like. Let's give them a like. All right. Thank you for your presentation, Rosa, in group. Good. Let's listen to group number two. Michelle, Ingrid, Ada, y no sé si se las agregó alguien más. All right. Okay, can you see my screen? Yes. Yes, okay. We will present the step number one. That is, define your audience. Know your audience. When you are working on a training manual, you should keep in mind what type of audience is targeted and how they will have access to this information. So, to understand your audience, you can ask yourself some of these questions. Question. What is their level of expertise? In what industry do they work? How much time do they have? Do they have a preference for reading of visual content? Next, Jancy. Okay. Answer this question will help you create to write content to satisfy the expectation and needs need of your audience. Take some time to develop and create training content, content that really solves your audience problems. That's it. Thanks for your attention. Okay, thank you very much. Uh, can you please uh, display the questions again? Okay. The questions, okay, you have some questions. Can you please display the questions again? The questions, okay, go back to the questions, the others, and these questions. Okay, listen. Remember, everybody, the idea here is to create an effective training manual, all right? La idea es crear un manual de capacitación efectivo, an effective training manual. And for this group, they say that it's important to know your audience when you create a manual. Es importante conocer la audiencia. So what, is the, what are the questions? What is their level of experience or expertise? In what industry do they work? The industry where they work, okay? How much time do they have working? And the preference for written or visual content. La idea es saber para incluir contenido visual o contenido escrito, it depends, right? So you need to know your audience, okay? Thank you very much, okay, uh, group. Uh, Michelle's group, can you stop sharing, please? Okay, everyone, uh, so please go to reactions and let's give them a heart, okay, please. Thank you for your presentation. Okay, uh, give me a minute, please, because something is wrong here. Algo va mal aquí ahorita en mi compu. Give me a second. Denme un minuto. Okay, but can you listen to me uh, well? Me, me escuchan bien? Can you listen to me well? Yes, teacher, yes. perfect. Sí, es que mi pantalla se mira así como borrosa, pero quizás algo, algún problema hay con la compu ahorita. There's a, a problem with my laptop. Nosotros lo vemos bien, teacher. 
Okay, perfect. That's the most important. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, my computer doesn't matter in this moment, all right? So uh, as long as you see me, <laughs> as long as you see me and you hear me, no problem, all right? Good. So uh, thank yes. you, Michelle, okay, uh, for your uh, participation. Le dimos un corazón, right? We gave them a heart, yes? Yes, 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 yes. I didn't give it, so here you are. Otra vez, teacher. <laughs> thank you very much. Very good. Now let's listen to group number um, three, Zulma, Gloria, Ofelia, group number three. Okay, I share. You see my presentation, Peter? Yes. yes. Okay. Yes. Um, we talk about step number two, plan your content. This document will be a guide to the user. You can be sure that the content in the training manual is organized and easy to comprehend. First, identify the themes. Then organize the themes by beginner to advance, job to be done, product feature, usage frequency, popularity among the audience, and finally create a table content. If you need a more complete, complete content, usually you can add subsections and create a table of contents in the final of manual. That's it. My goodness, it's very short. Thank you very much. <laughs> yes. yeah, don't, 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 don't make it disappear. Leave the presentation, please. So listen, uh, in the second step, we have plan your content, the content of the manual you are creating, okay, of the training manual you are creating. So here it's important, the training, I mean, for the manual to be organized, very organized and easy to comprehend, facile de comprender, easy to comprehend, don't complicate it, all right? Um, so you need to identify the themes or the topics from beginning to advance, job to be done or the task or I don't know, all right, depends. The frequency and blah, 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 yeah? So that's important here. So thank you very much, um, Surma Group. Thank you very much. We appreciate your presentation. Thank you. Okay, everyone, now please go to reactions and let's give them a wow. Oh, Angela was ready. She had given a wow already. <laughs> <laughs> she read my mind. She read my mind. She read my mind. She read my mind. Thank you very much. <laughs> now let's listen to group number four, Rafael and Flor. Can you chair floor, please? Okay, good evening, everybody. We are going to talk about step four of the of the how to create a training manual we are talked about the ter determining content presentation format continue floor please okay good evening the first we need to know our audience. After that, you have to identify the option for delivery. Afterwards, you consider the audience context. Then you select the topics more suitable to your video, text, or images. And finally, you combine different formats in one and provide read media to support content. Thanks. 
thanks for your attention. Okay, thank you very much. Can you leave the information, please, Rafael, or who is sharing? Quien está compartiendo? Okay, thank you. Listen, uh, the idea here is to look for the best format. If it's PDF, if it's Word, if it's a video, if it's, uh, if it's a collage, I don't know, all right? So you decide on the format for your training manual, all right? That's important here. So and is the and is the, the 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 format that is more suitable to the audience, okay? Mm -hmm. That's why you need to audience. That's why you need to know the audience, right? So it's the 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 resource that is more suitable to your audience, right? So it can be the video, PDF, um, picture, uh, any any material you are choosing, okay? Yeah, it can be a YouTube video. I don't know. Right, a TikTok nowadays. I don't know. All right, it's it's up to you, right? Yeah. Good. Thank you very much, Rafa. Can you stop sharing, please? Okay. Thank you. Now let's go to reactions and let's give them a like. We are in order. All right. We are going in order. So let's give them a like. Thank you very much. Oh, Darwin is giving confetti. Congratulations, all right. Thank you very much. Good. Now, let's listen to the next group, Darwin and Nelson. Okay, Nelson, present. Okay. In the moment. Okay. Give me a moment, please. Okay. Okay, good okay. evening, teachers and partners. We are a group number five. Step, step four, develop your content. Procedure for edition of recording the video. First, recite the topic and content. Afterwards, download and install APP Camtasia. Next, recording video. After that, edit video. Then, review video. And finally, Send email with video at person in church. Can I interrupt you, uh, Darwin? Sorry, this is in case uh, you are making a video for the manual, right? Yeah, so this is in case you are making a video for the training manual. Okay, thank you. Uh, Darwin, continue, please. Okay, okay. Step four, develop the content in this step are the procedures and tools that facilitate the recreation of a training manual video. At this point, you're ready to start developing your content for video-based training manual. If you're creating videos for your training manual, this is when you can start a short version scripting, recording, and editing videos. If you never create videos before, don't be discouraged from taking this approach. TechSmith Camtasia is a great tool. Use it be professional video. Be a creator, but it's easy for beginners to get started with. There are also some of great tutorials that will get you creating in no time. In this moment, Nelson explained the APP. Okay. okay, first in the procedure the uh, uh, in requiring in, in the, the video, the manual training, in the first download in start Camtasia. Afterward, 
there are two ways to record in RDNX. For example, in this case, from within PowerPoint, uh, is necessary is open uh, apl apply uh, Camtasia in PowerPoint. Uh, in PowerPoint is uh, in the way add ins. In the moment uh, you uh, you can uh, uh, recording. In Camtasia is apply recording PowerPoint is to wait. Then setting up recording video. Uh, for example, begin recording your PowerPoint presentation, record audio in the PowerPoint slide, record camera, camera with the PowerPoint presentation, display the camera preview during recording, click the recording option, icon the choose the specific setting the for recording, including recording the mouse, cursor, video in audio format, audio serve, camera, setup, hotkey for record, pause, and stop. Adding other steps that during recording, click record to launch the slide. Is this, sorry, slide this show. Check the microphone. Nice microphone. Show. Okay, thank you. Check the microphone microphone input yeah. lever. When you're ready, select the click to begin recording button of the hotkey. Number three, control the PowerPoint presentation as you normally were during the recording. Number four, press escape to start record the recording. After recording, and at the end, the recording, choose the weather to start recording or continue recording. If you choose to continue recording, click the stop recording button and the PowerPoint recording toolbar. After you save the file, choose, choose whether to procedure your recording or edit your recording before producing it. Then, Canceling or record a recording, press escape. When the site Camtasia recording us, dialog box appear, click cancel. Number three, when the dialog box appear, asking if you are sure you want to delay to recording to the to current video capture, click yes. Next, review and edit video check some detail or correct it. For example, uh, uh, in, the, in the app is uh, edit the video. In the doll, uh, the window doll is uh, edit the, the audio, the pen. And finally, send a mail with video a person in chair. Thank you, is that. Okay, thank you, Darwin and, and Nelson. Oh my God, you took it very seriously. You even gave the process. Te si la tomaron en serio, el proceso dieron, you gave the process for Cantasia, okay? Thank you very much. <laughs> okay. That's yeah. very appreciated, very good, thank you. So the All step right. you were uh, sharing is develop your content, right? Este era el paso que tenían, that's the step you have. Develop your content, yes? Yes, yes. Okay, so it's like desarrollar el contenido, right? So it's supposedly, uh, you can do it through a video using Camtasia. Camtasia is to make videos, right? Yes. Yes. All right. Thank you very much. Good presentation. Thank you. It's a okay, provider everybody. of Camtasia. Sorry? Nelson is a provider of Camtasia. Oh, really? <laughs> oh, my goodness. <laughs> Darwin, too. <laughs> but it's not hack, right? <laughs> it's a good expression. Okay, very good. So let's go to reactions and let's give them um congratulations okay let's give them congratulations <laughs> oh my god soccer ball is that is giving a soccer ball <laughs> all right thank you very much and let's listen to the last group with assemble and deliver your manual in some blood y entregar el manual okay so that's angela enos me 
and the others, all right? Now the manual is ready. Um, step five, assemble and deliver your manual. Go ahead, okay. Listen. Okay, uh, to assemble the training manual, the easiest way is to create a template in Snagit. This, this will seek to select image or videos that we need to include in the menu. Add text, establish order, and make the process easier. Snagit includes templates that can be used for free and paid, premium templates, and other resources in each Smith asset for Snagit. The document can be saved in PDF or as an image and is ready for sharing. Another option could be to create a base support center with Sendex or Medica Flare, Flare, Flare tools. If you are creating an online knowledge base, you should be able to use video, image, and writing content all at the same time. So get creative and make content that covers everything your audience might need. Okay, thank you very much. Don't stop sharing, please. No dejen de compartir. Don't stop sharing, please. So basically, in this step, you have everything ready. Here you are putting all the things together. Aquí ya unimos todo. We put all the things together. We assemble everything, okay? We have the videos, we have the images, we have the everything you need, todo lo que necesitan, everything you need. And we are ready to assemble the manual and give it to the trainees. Y darlo a los que se van a capacitar. Give it to the trainees, maybe, all right? So thank you very much, um, Miguel's group. Thank you. All right, thank you. Stop sharing, please. Okay, so please, everybody, go to reactions and let's give them a heart. Let's give them a heart. Okay. En ese momento quizás se deben estar preguntando, el teacher está loco con esa información que hemos visto. <laughs> I imagine, right? No, listen. Uh, no, yeah. teacher. No, no, right. <laughs> it's important. It's important. Okay, listen. It's important. Uh, this, this, this has two purposes, okay? This has two purposes. Well, many purposes, but the most important are two purposes. Purpose number one is, of course, um, to, fam to get familiar uh, with the ways to make a training manual. That's one. And second is to get familiar with new vocabulary and information, okay? To get familiar with new vocabulary and information and pronunciation is important here too. So here we kill many birds with one shot. Matamos varios pájaros de un solo tiro. We kill many, many birds with one shot, okay? El idioma original o la frase idiomática original es um, to kill a bird with one shot. Matar varios pájaros con un tiro. Kill birds with one shot. But I would Yo say lo digo kill al many revés. birds. Sorry? <laughs> Yo lo digo al revés. Yo digo, voy a matar un pájaro con dos tiros. <laughs> ah, okay. Uh, to kill a bird with two shots. Okay, no, no problem. No es así. <laughs> but in this case, we say to kill many birds with one shot. Matar bastantes pájaros con un tiro. To kill many birds yes. with one shot. Okay? So you can say that. Sí. Okay, so thank you very much for your presentations. I appreciate your participation. And I appreciate your hard work. I know it's not easy, but you did it. Okay, thank you very much for your uh, presentations, okay? So uh, then let's move to the next activity for today, but let me pass the attendance first. Buenas noches. Good morning. <laughs> Ada? Present. Adriana? Present, teacher. Ana Michelle? Present. Angela? Present teacher, present, present, present. Darwin. Present teacher. Flor. Present. Gloria. Here. Joanna. Present teacher. Very good. Joanna, ya no me puede faltar mucho. No teacher, ya no. Sorry. Okay, okay it's okay, no problem. Lourdes. I'm here teacher. All right, Margarita. I'm here. Mayra. Present. Miguel. Present teacher. Uh, Nelson. 
Present teacher. Ofelia. Here teacher. Okay, Osmin. Present. Rafael. Present. Sandra. Rosa, Present. sorry, Rosa, sorry, Rosa. Yes. <laughs> Sandra. Yes. Present teacher. Jansi. Present teacher. Zulma. Here. Okay. Azalia. Present. Ingrid. Susana. Present. All right, very good. It's good to see you, Susana. Very good. Okay, everybody. And now let's go to the next activity for today. And in the next activity for today, we have some uh, discussion questions, okay? These questions are very easy. And these questions are on page number 21. Okay, page number 21. Teacher, teacher. Yeah. Eh, quería decir algo. Bueno, lo voy a decir en español. Adelante. Me decirlo mucho. ¿eh? Fíjense que la vez pasada nosotros en un grupo estábamos hablando sobre eh, las sesiones uno a uno. ¿sí? Uh -huh. Y creíamos que era algo bueno, digamos, eh, porque a veces eh, usted nos ha dicho que si podemos llevar digamos, algún tema como para preguntar, o a nosotros se nos ocurre algo como preguntar, pero quizás nosotros debiésemos bien que usted también nos pudiera dar una retroalimentación sobre, eh, digamos, el, el, el manejo que estamos teniendo de tanto, eh, ¿cómo se llama? Eh, la parte de, de cómo decimos las cosas, de... Eh, el avance que estamos teniendo con, con, con cada uno de los módulos, creo que sería un poquito más este, eh, apro aprovechado mejor por nosotros. No sé si, si, si también, bueno, como por lo menos en ese grupo estábamos de acuerdo que, que, que fuese así, no sé si usted lo pudiera tomar como a consideración, Ticho. Uh -huh. Sí, por supuesto. Ajá. Uh -huh. Sí, sí, por supuesto, Miguel. Eh, Sí, ese, en este caso, ¿qué, qué, ¿qué le gustaría que incluyéramos? ¿En general, pronunciación o...? Por, o, no, o sea, digamos que la lógica sería... Sí, como es personalizado, por ejemplo, por decirle algo, mire, yo he notado que a usted le cuesta decir este, las, los verbos o que debe de mejorar en la parte de, de la lectura, no debe ser así. O sea, por decirle, quizás eh, yo en, en algún grupo me atreví a decir... Quizás al, a, alguna, algo que yo lo veo bien, ¿verdad? En los, eh, ahí usted considera, lo, teacher, por ejemplo, que yo les decía, mire, cuando ustedes estén diciendo una frase, si ustedes ven una coma, tienen que detenerse un poquito, o sea, no tienen que leer las, las, la lectura, no tienen que ser tan corrida, sino que hay que como tratarle de dar una idea muy rápido, a, la, muy a la, correcto, a la oración, uh -huh. o por lo menos que la oración sea, porque a veces... Las lecturas son como varias oraciones a la vez, ¿verdad? Entonces, uh -huh. pero a veces no, des, no, no pausamos en las comas, o no pausamos en los puntos, o no hacemos un énfasis en una, en una exclamación que se ve, ¿verdad? Como para que, porque, para que también darle un poquito más de sentido real a la hora de que cuando estamos, cuando ya vamos a estar hablando, pues, o sea, uh -huh. esa es quizá como una de las, sí, ah. algo así. Sí, entiendo. Vaya, eh, vamos a hacer una cosa entonces. Sí, me parece muy buena la, la idea, muy acertada. Eh, bien, lo que podrían, pues yo soy, yo sinceramente, en el momento que soy con ustedes va a ser quizás un poquito difícil que recuerde, ¿ok? De, de, para darle algunos puntos de vista, debido a la cantidad de información que se maneja, ¿verdad? Durante toda la clase, lo que podemos hacer es que ahorita que hace la sugerencia Miguel, yo puedo ir tomando notas de cada uno de ustedes, ¿ok? De cositas que vea, puedo ir tomando notas durante la sesión. Si veo algo, tomo notas. Si no, les digo en el momento, tal vez. Porque lo que hago yo a veces es que en el momento les hago la, la corrección, ¿verdad? O, o espero, que terminen de, eh, espero que terminen de participar y les hago la corrección en el momento. Si es correction, ¿ok? Pero si, si, si puedo hacerlo de esa manera y puedo ir tomando notas de algunos puntos también, Miguel. No hay ningún problema. Muchas gracias, teacher. Pero es, la idea es que sea personalizado, algo en lo que cada quien se, digamos, que, que, que algo, algo que cada quien necesite específicamente. 
Ajá, en la sesión uno a uno, aprovechar de decirnos, por ejemplo, eh, lo urdes, mire, usted tendría que mejorar en esto, porque eh, pero se podría apoyar, digamos, en esto, esto y eso. O sea, algo que nos ayude también a nosotros a conocer, porque probablemente yo esté hablando así de lo mejor y probablemente usted diga, no, pero le hace falta mucho aplicar el pasado, el futuro, eh, etcétera, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. Entonces siento de que a veces... Bueno, yo, ¿verdad? En lo personal, digo, bueno, espero ir pasando, pero no solo por pasar, sino realmente estoy haciendo bien las cosas o, o que me, o me hace falta que mejorar, perdón. Entiendo, entiendo. Ok, perfecto. Entonces, eh, bueno, yo me comprometo a ir en espacios que tenga, a ir tomando notas acerca de cosas así en específico de cada uno, ¿ok? Claro, cuando alguien no, este, algunos que yo los hago participar así un poquito como a la fuerza, ¿verdad?, es un poquito difícil, ¿ok? Es un poquito difícil, si no los escucho pero mucho. Pero sería, teacher, pero eso que hace usted, que los de, que trata, que todos participen, está bien. Porque hay muchos que nos acomodamos y no, y no queremos participar, ¿verdad? Y eso ayuda bastante, porque en mi caso, a mí me ayuda bastante en la, en la pronunciación, porque a mí me cuesta. Y se lo digo ahorita porque yo no voy a tener sesión, entonces... <ríe> Entonces, a mí me cuesta la pronunciación, ¿verdad? Entonces, eh, y me gusta que me corrijan. Okay. En mi caso, a mí me encanta que me corrijan porque estoy aquí para aprender, ¿verdad? Entonces, eso sería en mi caso. Ok, ¿verdad? excelente. Y, para mí, está bien. Ok, me excelente. Me también, Muchas gracias. Me too, okay. me too. <risa> ya voy a escuchar varias me too ahí. <risa> me too. Me too, me too, me too. Me too. A mí me cuesta también eso. Muchísimo, okay. siempre. Ok, excelente. Va, entonces, eh, en base a la sugerencia de Miguel, entonces me comprometo a ir tomando, voy a dejar un apartado en mi libretita que tengo, siempre tengo una libretita para hacer cosas aquí de la clase. Así que en mi libretita voy a dejar un apartado para ir tomando notas de algunas cositas, ¿ok? Así cositas que, que algunos tal vez necesitan mejorar y tal vez no decírselas en el momento todas, sino dejar algunas para después. Porque normalmente, si son generales, si no se las digo, ¿verdad? Tiene razón Miguel. Pero si son errores en el momento, solo los dejo que terminen y los corrijo. O si no lo hago en el momento, depende de la situación en la que estemos, ¿ok? Che, en lo personal, pues, me gusta que en el momento me corrija. Porque de repente, por... la verdad es que en el inglés, yo, de hecho, a veces digo algo y lo digo insegura. Y cuando usted, y a veces en el momento necesito como la ayuda, su ayuda, que me diga, no, esto no es así, esto es así, va. Porque uh -huh. ahí es donde, donde voy memorizando, por decirlo así. Sin embargo, siento yo que no es tan fácil. Me okay. cuesta. Excelente. Ok, thank, thank you, you very much. Fácil. Thank you. Ok, sí, sí, este, tal vez en el caso de correcciones, sí, ¿verdad? Siempre manejarlos así. Y cosas que son un poquito más generales, tal vez, hacerlo de esa manera, Miguel. Por ejemplo, que necesita practicar más el futuro, lo que llega el momento le hago la corrección, que use la, la oración en futuro, le doy la opción, ¿ok? Pero darla en general para que practique cada uno. Uh -huh. ¿Ok? ¿De acuerdo? Yes. Ok. Thank you very much for the suggestion, ¿ok? Si me escuchan un poquito raro es porque tengo bien tapada la nariz ahorita, estoy un poquito congestionado, ¿ok? Um, very good. So let's continue. No problem, teacher. Ay, ay, dice. Good night. Ah, lo escuchaba bien. Ay, teacher, vaya a descansar, teacher, se lo merece. Teacher. Ok, me le adelanté a Sally ahora, ya iba a decir good night, creo ya. Ok, very good. Uh, so now uh, I said we have two questions on page number 21, ok? These questions are, are somehow easy. Question number one is: Is there a manual with procedures in your workplace? I mean, is there a manual with procedures in your workplace, in the company where you work? Do you think this manual can be improved? ¿Piensan que puede ser mejorado si lo han leído? Do you think this manual can be improved? Si no hay, you say, no, there isn't. Okay, no, there isn't a manual in my company. Okay, but we, we need one, you can say. Okay, yeah. Okay, so take three minutes and answer the questions, please. Page number 21. Thank you, teacher. Deme un minuto, solo voy a ir a traer el agua porque tenía por acá y el niño me la llevó, no sé para dónde. <laughs> Just give me a minute. Okay, teacher, okay, teacher. Okay.
Okay, I'm back. ¿Quién, ¿Quién cambió ayer la sesión uno a uno? Mi teacher, Mayra. Mayra, ¿por quién? Por Margarita, ¿verdad? Sí, Margarita no estaba. Ok, Margarita, so you have the chance today, Margarita. Margarita, hello. Bueno, Margarita estaba conectada. Sí. Teacher. Ya. Yeah. Ya se le fue otra vez, teacher. <risa> teacher. Ya no la veo. Eh, for me, my, my session one to one, yeah. I don't have because. Yeah, yeah because busy. I had a problem. Uh, I yes, had a problem. Yes, yes. Ya, yeah, ya, yeah. sí, pero esa se va, yo, yo creo, no me han dicho nada, pero mi, bueno, la verdad no he consultado, pero como uh -huh. se perdieron esos 10 minutos, me imagino que vamos a tener que hacerla en una sesión. Ah, ok. Ajá, porque mandé, bueno, voy a consultar mañana, a ver qué me dicen, a ver qué día se puede agendar, ok. Ok, thank you. Ok. Okay, are you ready? Uh, for this yes, part, uh, for this part, yes. you don't you don't have to give long answers, right? Okay, it's not necessary to give long answers. Okay, so for example, for question number one, is there a manual with procedures in your workplace? You say yes, there is, or no, there isn't. Only that, okay? Yes, there is, or no, there, or there isn't. Is. No, there isn't. Okay, isn't. Yes, there is, or no, there isn't. Uh -huh. Imagine you say, yes, there is. Do you think this manual can be improved? And then you say, yes, I do. Because it has many things, maybe it has many, or it has information which is not um, important. I don't know, okay, it's your, you know how you have your manual in your company, right? Good. When, when we say procedures, we are talking in general, all right? It's in general, yeah? So these questions are on page number uh, 21, I said, right? So let me take the questions here. Okay, so let's start then uh, sharing the answers. We are going to do it here in the class, okay? So let's see, um, Floor. Uh, can you select someone to ask the questions, please? Can you select someone to ask the questions, please? Um, Angela. Angela, so Flor, listen. 
You will ask Angela and Angela will ask you, okay? Yeah. So you ask first. Tu pregunta primero. You ask first. Okay, Angela, is there a man manual with procedures in your workplace? There are. Do you think this manual can be improvised? Uh, yes. Um, yes. <laughs> Okay, Angela, now you ask Flor. Uh, Florcita, is there are manual, manual with procedures in your code workplace? Yes, there is. Okay. Do you do you think this manual can be improved? Improved? No, not the the eye. No, in this case, you say, no, I don't. You see, si crees que no puede ser mejorado, you say, no, I don't. I think I it's don't. okay. You say, I think it's okay. You can say, creo que está bien. I think it's okay. No, I don't. I think it's okay. I think it's okay. All right. <laughs> okay, thank you, Flor and Angela. Now, uh, thank you very much. Let's see. Um, Darwin, can you select someone, please? Mayra Melan. Okay, so you ask Mayra and then Mayra ask you, okay? Okay. Okay, Mayra, is there is there a manual with procedure in your workplace? No, there isn't. Okay. Do you think this manual can be improvised? Mm, no there. <laughs> you, you can say no because we don't have a manual. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Now you ask Mayra, ask Darwin, please. Okay, Darwin. Is there a manual uh, with procedures in your workplace? Yes, there is. Okay. Do you think this manual can be improved? No, I don't, because in my company, the manual of procedure is according to the, the topic. Okay. Excellent. Very good. I like it. Thank you very much, Mayra and Darwin. All right. Let's see um, Gloria. Can you select someone, please? Susana. Susana, okay, ask Susana, and the second time, Susana asks you, all right? Susana, is there a manual with procedure in your workplace? Yes, in my workplace are many procedures, from how to put a uniform to how to have a medicine prepared. Do you think this manual can be improvised? To work with continuous improvement. Over time, many processes can change and improve. Okay, good answer. Now, Susana, you ask Gloria. Okay, Gloria, is there a manual with procedures in your workplace? Yes, there is. Do you think this manual can be improved? Uh, yes, I can believe. As there are some subs and some gaps Steps. que se pueden mejorar. Ah, que se pueden, sorry. Mejorar. Ah, you can say yes, it can be improved. You can say yes, I do. It can be improved. It can be improved. Puede ser mejorado. It can be improved. Okay. Repeat it, please. It can be improved. Improve. It can be. It can be. Improve. 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 Okay. Thank you, Gloria and Susana. Thanks. Okay. Lourdes, can you please select someone? Okay. Who 
who is missing, teacher? Ah, uh, many. Osmin, Nelson, uh, Miguel. Okay, Nelson. Okay, Nelson. Ask Nelson, and the second time, Nelson will ask you. Okay. Teacher, I have a problem with the error. I pray. Okay, okay, it's okay. Okay. Nelson, um, can you hear? Give me a question, please. Oh, okay. Okay. Um, the first question is, sorry, I, I lost the page. Wait me, please. It's page 21. Yes, yes. It's my movie or teacher permit. 21. Okay. Is there a manual with procedures? No, no, sorry. It's on the screen. Yes. It's on the screen. Okay. Thank Is you, that... teacher. Okay. Is there a manual with procedures in your workplace? Yes, there is. Do you think this manual can be improved? Um, yes. Uh, sorry. Okay. Yes, there, yes, there are. Yes, there is. Ah, uh, in this on the second question, you say yes, I do, Nelson, because the question uh, yeah. is, do you? Yes, I okay. do. Yes, I do. Okay, yes, I do. Ah, I okay, think, thank okay. you. Yes. Okay, thank you very much, Nelson and uh, Lourdes. Thank you very much. Now, let's go to the next activity for uh, today. Now, listen. Listen, please. We are going to practice a conversation. But after you practice, pay attention here. After you practice, you will create two conversations in pairs, okay? And I will tell you later. So please pay attention to the conversation and the pronunciation, all right? And the structure, yeah? Okay, so let me pronounce two times for you. I will pronounce two times for you. Uh, the conversation is on the same page, page number uh, 21, okay? Page number 21. So please listen carefully. We need to create the main steps to include in the manual to train our staff. What do you propose? First, servers need to know the correct way to present the menu. Wouldn't it be better if chapter one is about how servers should greet the customers and after that, how they need to present the menu? Actually, it would be better if we include the server's dress code and appearance in the first chapter. Listen again. We need to create the main steps to include in the manual to train our staff. What do you propose? First, servers need to know the correct way to present the menu. Wouldn't it be better if chapter one is about how servers should greet the customers and after that, how they need to present the menu? Actually, it would be better if we include the server's dress code and appearance in the first chapter. Now, any new vocabulary for you? Can you see new vocabulary? Uh, appearance. Appearance. Okay, appearance. appearance. Okay, what else? Servers. Servers. All right, let me see where is it uh, here. Okay, servers. Any other new word? Chapter, chapter, chapters. Oh, oh chapter. chapter. All right, the first chapter. Okay, I will, I will highlight all the phrases. Okay, the first chapter. What else? Servers. Servers. We have servers propose. here. Ah, propose. propose. All right. What do you propose. propose? What do you propose? What else? Servers con apostrophe. Let me see where is it. I don't see it. In which part is it? Ah, servers dress code. This one? Code. Ah. Ah. Servers dress code. 
Okay, what else? Only that? What is it would be better? What is it would be better? It sería mejor. Ah, mejor. sería mejor, sería mejor. It would be better, sería mejor. And in negative, wouldn't it be better? Is no sería mejor, right? Okay, no negative. Sería mejor. Uh -huh. Good. Now let's check. Uh, what do you propose? Propose is like the word says, right? Proponer. Okay, what do you propose? ¿Qué propones? What do you propose? Servers. What is servers? Mesero. No. Meseros. Meseros. Okay. But do you remember that we started Servidores. waiter and waitress? Uh huh. We, we started waiter and waitress. Servidores, but in a restaurant. So it's meseros, right? Okay. Los que sirven la comida. Okay. So it's like waiter or waitress. Okay. But servers is for men and women. All right. Good. For why? Why teacher? Correct. Why? The correct way. a way. Way. Uh, la to, forma correcta. The correct way. Train, train. To train our. To train our staff. Capacitar yes. nuestro, nuestro personal. To train our staff. Okay. To train is like capacitar o entrenar, okay? Okay. Okay, way is like forma. The correct way, la forma correcta. The correct way. Um, servers dress code es el código de vestuario de los meseros ok yeah, the servers dress code acuérdense que la apóstrofe esa en un nombre hace un posesivo ¿recuerdan? do you remember that? yes, For yes. Example, Bernardo's yes. computer, la computadora de Bernardo so it makes a possessive, right? so here you say el código de vestimenta o de vestuario de los meseros Possessive, okay? Appearance, what is appearance? That's easy. Appearance. In the first chapter. What is in the first chapter? Primer capítulo. En el primer capítulo. Okay? Están hablando del manual, recuerden, okay? The steps to, to include in the manual, okay? Yeah? Okay, any question about pronunciation? Maybe one word that is difficult for you to pronounce? Appearance, 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 chapter, chapter, chapter is the same, chapter, chapter, Chap appearance, chapter, appearance, appearance. Propose. propose, 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 train our staff, train our staff, train, 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 train. Our, train. 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 Okay. train our staff, way uh, servers, servers yeah the correct way servers way. menu okay menu okay menu 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 we need to create the main steps to, be, to include in the manual to train our staff. What do you propose? First, servers need to know the correct way to present the menu. Present the menu. No es present. Okay, it's present. Okay. Si dicen present, present es presente. Y aquí es presentar. Es como process y process. Lo mismo. Okay, la misma regla. Okay, so you say present the menu. Okay, present the menu. Wouldn't it be better if chapter one is about how servers should greet the customers and after that, how they need to present the menu? Actually, it would be better if we include the server's dress code and appearance in the first chapter. Page number 21. Page number 21, okay? Y cuando regresemos, quiero ver más cámaras encendidas. Ok, I want to see more cameras on, porque la mitad está con la cámara apagada. Ok, y recuerden la instrucción al principio, ok. Recuerden la instrucción okay. al principio. Solo si están de oyentes, sí uh -huh. entiendo, right? I understand, ok. Los que están en reunión, it's ok, I understand. Ok, very good. So then, uh, we are going to practice the conversation in pairs. I will give you like three minutes to practice, ok. Like three minutes to practice. Any questions? Okay. 
No, no, no question. No question. No. Okay, let's go to practice in pairs. Todos van a practicar. Hay alguien que no yes. vaya a participar. Que no. veo varios con cámara apagada. No. Okay, let's go to practice in pairs. Si no tienen pareja, me me piden ayuda. You ask for help, please. You first. Okay, okay I'm gonna start. Okay. We need. Ah, no, me Sara. You Sara, okay. We need to create the main step to include in the manual to train our staff. What do you propose? Weird. Herbert needs to know the correct way to present the, the menu. Wouldn't it be better if chap, chapter on is about how servers show grade the customer and after that, how they need to present the menu? The menu? Actually, it will be better if we include the server dress code um, a pre a appearance in the first chapter. Mm -hmm. Appearance. 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 Yeah. Appearance. Yeah. Appearance. Yeah. Appearance. Yeah. Appearance. Yeah. Appearance. Yeah. Okay, appearance. And appearance in the first chapter. Um, James. You start. Okay. We need to create the main step to include in the manual to train all staff. What do you propose? First, service needs to know the correct way to present the menu. When it it be better if chapter one is about how servers should rate the customer and after that how they need to the present the menu. Yes, it's, it's correct, teacher, present the menu. Present the menu. Present the menu. Uh -huh. present, okay. Present. Present the menu. Present, present the menu. Present the menu. The menu. Yes. Present the menu. Present the menu. No present. No que present the menu. Present. Presentar el menú. Exactamente. Como verbo es present. Okay. Present. Si quiero decir presente es present. Present. Okay. Present the menu. 
<laughs> Actually, it will be better if we include the server dress code and appearance in the first chapter. Appearance is for the teacher. Appearance. 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 Okay. Me cuesta esa palabra. Appearance. Es nueva. Yes. Ok. Uh, Continúo. O cambiamos. Ok, ok. Uh -huh. We need to create the main step to include in the main. Um, after that. Of the list to present the menu. Actually, it would be better if we include the server's dress code and appearance in in the first chapter. Excuse me. me. Hmm? Hello, Rafa. Hello. Yo estoy, yo estoy en otro grupo con Sandra. Lo que pasa es que estoy de otro dispositivo porque la computadora me está pagando. Ah, y yo te moví porque vi que estaba solo en, de, de último en un grupo. <laughs> Ajá, pero ya estoy con Sandra. Ok, no problem. It's ok. No problem. Oh, Pueden dominar la técnica de la teletransportación. Wow. <laughs> Actually, it's cool be better if we include the service dress code and appearance in the first chapter. Ok, Shane Rose. I first. We need to create the main step to include in the manual to train our staff. What do you propose? First, service needs to know the correct way to present the menu. Wouldn't it be better if chapter one is about, is about how server should rate the customer and after that, how they need to present the menu? Actually, if it will be better if, if we include the service dress code and ever appearing in the first chapter. Okay, your first change. What I said. Yes, I did. Okay, everyone. Okay, uh, thank you very much for taking the time to practice, okay? This time we are not going to share because we are going to share differently in a moment, okay? So listen. For the next activity, you are going to work in pairs. I guess with the same pair. Creo que irán con la misma pareja. I guess you are going with the same pair. Is that okay for you? ¿Está bien? Is that okay? Yes, 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 yes. Yes, yes. I can see Angela like her pair a lot. <laughs> okay, very good. Now listen. Listen carefully. You are going to write two conversations, okay? One conversation for you and one conversation for your classmate because you are going to work in pairs, okay? What is the idea? Okay, let me show you. The idea is that you create a conversation about procedures in your company, okay? I repeat, the conversation will be about procedures in your company. And you can use this, this, this conversation as an example. It can be about a manual, okay? You can start by saying, for example, we need to create the main steps to include in the manual to train our staff. You can say, for example, we need to create the main, the main steps um, uh, for the procedure of, and you say the procedure, right, of, uh, what? Turning on a machine? I don't know. All right. Yeah. And then what do you propose? First, and then you start. Okay. Talking about the, the procedures. Okay. Or what do you prefer? ¿Qué prefieren? ¿Hacerla cerca de un manual o hacerla cerca de un proceso? Le voy a dar opciones. I will give you options. Un proceso? Podría ser. Procedures? Are you sure? Yes, yes, but one conversation, teacher. Sorry? 
Only one. Only one conversation. No, yo dije dos conversaciones porque la idea es que el que hablaran, digamos, que, que, que cada quien hable de su proceso en la conversación, ¿ok? But if you want to create one, well, anyways, I guess we have like 18 minutes. Okay, one conversation then, okay? Because we have like 18 minutes to finish. Okay, so one conversation then. And the conversation will be about procedures. Well, it's your decision. You can write about procedures or steps to include in a manual to train the, the employees, okay? It's your decision. Procedures or steps for a manual to train employees, okay? You decide, ustedes deciden, you decide, okay? Y le va a quedar más o menos así la conversación. Traten de usar, wouldn't it be better or it would be better, okay? Para hacer sugerencias, okay? ¿Alguna pregunta? Any question? No, yes, me. Okay, Zulma. Um, we need to create two conversation. <laughs> no, create, yes. Create only one. Solo decidan de qué compañía la van a hacer, de, de cualquiera de los dos, okay? Yes, because we don't ah, have too much time. We right. have only 17 minutes, all right? So you made the decision, all right? Yes, Zulma? Okay. Only one conversation. It's okay. All right. Any other question? Okay. Thank you. Okay. Please, the two, the two of you need to have the conversation. Ambos deben tener la conversación. Okay. Questions? Okay. No questions? No. Mm -hmm. All right. Let's go to right. the conversation. You have 16 minutes. 16 minutes. 16 minutes. Ah, justo lo que nos falta. <laughs> What happened, Sulma? cuál podríamos eh... ah por ejemplo tenemos procedimientos para reportar eh, incidentes ya yeah, sí, sí. incidentes de problemas de clientes por ejemplo sí. entonces eh, si quiere le voy a compartir mi pantalla para que lo vayamos redactando okay, gracias y quiero ver. Voy, voy, voy. You see, eh, Osmin? Yes, ahí. Ok. Bye. Entonces tendríamos que tomar de referencia este. Dice, vaya, vamos a poner eso mismo. 
Vamos a ver. Eh, sería eh, we need. Nosotros necesitamos crear. The main step. The main step. O oh, no sé si usted tiene a la mano el libro, eh, Osmin, para que me diga. Sí, lo tengo el libro acá. Ah, vaya. Sí. Ah, pues eh, estoy lo primerito. Va. Main steps to include. Steps to include. Ya. Vaya, eh, sería un procedimiento en este caso. Procedimiento. Procedimiento. Para reportar. Eh, no, problemas serían problemas con con la ajá, con la banca en línea por ejemplo oh, yeah. sí. in the process to report problems with the Bien, sí in the follow Teacher, to yes. para llenar. Podríamos hacer un proceso, pero no necesariamente que, que esté como en un manual de una empresa, por lo general. Yeah, yeah, that's what I was saying. You can have two options, a procedure or maybe a manual. It's up to you. Mm -hmm. What okay. is the different, teacher? I don't know. I don't. I don't have. I don't have clear. The difference between procedure and uh, in manual. Middle. Yeah, yeah. I mean, the thing is that we are we, uh, as you know, in the previous activity. I mean, in the activity in the first activity of the class, we talk about creating a manual, right? Creating a manual. Um, I mean, a training manual, all right? Or the steps to create a training manual. So that's one option you have to create the conversation, and the other option is to talk about a procedure, even if you don't have the manual, aunque no tengan el manual. A veces hay procesos en el manual. Sometimes we have procedures, mm -hmm. but we have no manual. Mm -hmm. okay. So that's the difference. Mm -hmm. Eso es lo que trataba de decirle <laughs> bien. Ajá, yeah. sí, porque <laughs> le, le comentaba a Miguel que, por ejemplo, el protocolo de, ese, de bioseguridad al entrar a un lugar es un proceso, pero no necesariamente va a estar en un manual de una empresa. Exactly. Ok. Bye. Excellent. Ok, we need to create the main step to the follow fulfill. Para llenar. Uh, what do you mean by fulfill? Vamos a... Completar. What do you mean when you say fulfill? Completar. En ese caso sería que necesitamos seguir. Ah, seguir. Bueno, pero seguir es de follow, de follow. Uh -huh. Nosotros necesitamos crear en los principales pasos para seguir qué. Me dijo no, Sería necesitamos. Sería seguir. Para seguir. El proceso de bioseguridad. Para cumplir. No. Ajá, ah, para cumplir. cumplir. ¿Cómo sería cumplir? ¿Cumplir? Comply. No, not is fulfilled. Comply. comply. In this case, it's comply. To comply. Comply. No, I don't know. To, ah, to write. Pues, comply. Ah, cumplir. No. To comply. 
Compli. No, comply como compli. P L Y. P L Y. P L Y. P L Y. Comply. P L. Ah, P L Y. Why? 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 Ah, ah, why? Ah, comply. Okay. Okay. We have to follow to comply. The bioseguridad. Ah, the protocol, the, the bioseguridad protocol. Algo así. Con el protocolo sería with. To comply with the protocol. All right? Comply ah. with. With. Esas palabras se usan juntas. Comply with. Ok. Comply with. Ah, ok. Con Biosecurity. Biosecurity protocol. Biosecurity. 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 Ah, biosecurity. Unido. Biosecurity protocol. In en el lugar de trabajo. Las indicaciones. Dale la palabra. Carpet. Me contesta con otra pregunta. Ajá. ¿No sería mejor este que a cada empleado se le dé sus propias indicaciones? Para para trabajar en la semana pudiera ser para el tra para para ¿Cómo? sí así algo así para para ok para trabajar ajá yo así hago para elaborarlas en la semana sí ajá. el sonido para sí. trabajarlas para trabajarlas para trabajar en la semana ¿va? en la semana es como ellos necesitan presentar el menú. Ah, pero aquí porque ellos están haciendo un manual. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Entonces, capítulo 1. Entonces, en ese caso no podría ser, no sería mejor que la empresa capacitara al personal para usar el sistema. Ajá, primero. Uh -huh. Ajá. Ajá, no sería mejor, sería, ajá, wouldn't it be It'd be better if, if the company, the company capacitar train training train training training capacitar uh, solo capacitar train trains trains wouldn't it wouldn't it be better if the company trains train. The okay. employees or the staff, I don't know. Okay. Mm -hmm. The employees. Mm -hmm. It'd be better. If the company trains. The company trains. Trains. Que la compañía capacitara of the about about the use SAP system. Acerca del uso del sistema SAP. First. Pero después de, después de training no iría de employees. Ah, yes, yes. Bye. Capacitar. Capacitar. Uh -huh. uh -huh. Two employees. At two employees. Train. At. ¿Cómo le pusiste? If company trains. The employees. No tenemos. A los empleados. Ajá. Solo da. Da employees. 
Is correct, teacher? Or not correct? Sorry, uh, Darwin. Uh, for example, the, the sentence, uh, the company trains the employees. Capacitar a los trabajadores. Mm -hmm. But say all the sentences, please. It would be better if the company trained the employees. Yeah, mm -hmm. wouldn't eat. You say wouldn't eat. Porque dijimos que no sería mejor, mm -hmm. right? No sería mejor mm -hmm. que la compañía entrenara a los, a los empleados. So you say wouldn't it be better if the company trains the employees? Mm -hmm. Ah, pues, oh. yes, yes. Mm -hmm. If the employees... It's okay, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. If the company mm -hmm. trains mm -hmm. the employees, Tommy. If the company mm -hmm. trains, trains the employees. The employees. Mm -hmm. Yeah. The employees. About in... the, about the use uh, of subsystem. First, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. the employees in subsystem. Mm -hmm. Okay. In the use. In the use. Uh -huh. In a subsystem. Mm -hmm. Um, y después, uh -huh. actually, de hecho, sería mejor. Sí, nosotros sí. incluimos el, los, si incluimos un, un código de vestuario para los meseros, ¿verdad? Entonces, ahí podríamos poner. Eh, si de hecho sería mejor si creáramos el procedimiento uh -huh. Uh -huh. o revisáramos el procedimiento ajá y, y revisáramos las las mm, las o tareas que realizan Ah, o las tareas. Ajá, que realizan eh, los analistas de costos para poder crear el procedimiento. Correcto, correcto. Entonces sería, actually, it would be better if, if we if review, we review the or, activities. Or Ajá, ver, verify, verificar también. Ah. Verify the activity. Uh -huh. The activities eh, that make the analyst cost personal o, o las actividades que realiza el personal de analista de costos. Hi, teacher. Hello, did you finish? Sure. Yes. 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 Okay, perfect. Let's go then. Okay. <laughs> Thank All you. Right. Thank yeah. you, Gloria. Bueno, gracias, Susana. Bye. Bye. Need more time, teacher. I'm sorry. Um, you need more time. Yes. Yes. Okay. Uh, can you please raise your hand if you didn't finish? Levanten la mano los que no terminaron. The ones who didn't finish. Go to reactions and raise your hand, please. Miguel, Sandra. Los que no terminaron. Los que no terminaron. Levante la mano, vayan a reacción de los que no terminaron y levante la mano para ver cuánto falta. 
<ríe> ok, veamos. Miguel, ¿con quién va? No bajen la mano. ¿Con quién vas, Miguel? Yancy. Con Yancy, ok. Ahí se ponen en contacto para que termine, porque ahorita ya no tenemos tiempo, ok. Para que sepan nada más. Get in touch, please. All right. See you tomorrow, Yancy. Good morning, please. So you can WhatsApp yourself, ok. Ahí pónganse de acuerdo para Good ver. Night, Miguel. Yeah. Sandra, ¿con quién va? Rafael, creo que... Sí, Rafael. Ah, con Rafael, the same, all right? You get in touch with Rafael, all right? Chavalos que levantaron las manos, teacher, son las parejas. Ok, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> ok, um, all right. Ahí se ponen en contacto entonces para que terminen dos parejas, ok? Para que terminen y mañana presentamos a primera hora. Ok, no vayan a dejar a su pareja sola. O solo, ok? Si no están... Solo no con su soledad. Presentar. Así que por favor... Okay, so please get connected early tomorrow. Okay, let me pass the attendance and then we go. All right, Ada? Present. Adriana? Present, teacher. Ana Michelle? Present. Angela? Present, teacher. Good Darwin. night. Good night, Darwin? Good night. Gloria? Teacher. Good night. Here? Joanna? <laughs> Mi teacher no Ay, me mencionó. Estoy despechada. Sorry. No me mencionó, teacher. Aquí no me A Flor. Ok, Flor, sorry. <laughs> Good night. Good night. Um, Lourdes. Good night, teacher. Margarita. Good night, Mayra. Saludos, le dejo a teacher. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> <laughs> Miguel. Present teacher. Yes, son. Present teacher. Teacher. <laughs> yeah. Don't forget the the task, the, the platter for everybody. Mm, para esta semana no hay, Nelson. Es para la oh, otra. The other week. Yes. Re recuerden que la sección 2, la sección 2, que es esta sesión en la que estamos, dura dos semanas. Ok, dura yeah. dos semanas. Entonces la tarea, pero gracias por hacer el recordatorio para que vayan avanzando porque no les he recordado, ok? Así que la sección 2 debería estar completa para la siguiente semana, el miércoles, ¿ok? Pero si ya la terminaron, mejor aún. Gracias a Dios, ok, thanks God. ¿Okay? Es cierto, yo no he hecho nada, ni me acordaba. Ah, bueno, entonces, buena, Nelson. Me tú, Azalia, me tú. Sí, es para el miércoles Angie, de la otra semana. Angie me sigue, me tú siempre. <risa> las me tú. Forever, las me too. Angie. Las me tú. Yes, me tú. Ofelia. <laughs> Ofelia. Ofelia. Yes, teacher. Okay, Osmin. Present teacher. Good night. Rafa, good night. Present, good night. Good night, Rosa. Present. Sandra. La más que tiene Rafael quisiera yo. Present. Present. Turma. Present. Azalia. Eh, good night. Present. Right. Good night. Good night. <laughs> Ahora sí, good night. Good night. <laughs> good night, everybody. Okay, good night. Ingrid. San Susana. Ahora que no sé con no, no sale. Present. Okay. Okay, everybody. Thank you. Thank you for connecting. Okay, Susana. Thank you for connecting. Good night. Take care and see you tomorrow. Okay. Good, good night, good teacher. Bye. Good night, good night. Bye. Uh, everybody. All right. Good night, everybody. Good see night. You tomorrow. Sweet.